Shalom, child of God. Uh, welcome all, all, and thank you so much for being here. As us, I want to thank you all, uh, and I don't take it for granted. And I want to lead uh, the word of today. As I was cooking food, I remembered and I said uh, about this channel. As we always say, our channel is all about uh, spiritual food spiritual food as we all every day we have to eat food and this food we eat like three times a day we have breakfast we have lunch and we have dinner and also in between we have snacks so today uh, as i was cooking it read ah oh, i'm looking the food my today i'm cooking food for my body what about my spiritual food for today i haven't so i came along this word and i said ah, i have to give out my spiritual uh, food i have to serve it as i will serve my physical food the thing is that most of the time we take these things uh, like a joke but they help a lot you can't live without drinking water you can't live without food as well we should take this word of god and i tell you every verse of the of the day one just one verse it will you know it will keep you moving it will give your spirit uh, more energy. Uh, so today we are going to read uh, in the book of Psalms chapter 51 and verses um, 14. And before, let's pray. Father, we thank you. We bless your name, O God Almighty. Thank you for your word. Thank you for giving this word. It normally helps us to live in this world, O God. Let us not take it for granted, O Lord. If we want to live according to your will, Lord, it will teach us, it will help us, it will guide us. It is it's all that we need in this life. God, we thank you as we lead your word. Let it speak to us, let it teach us, and let it feed our spirit. In Jesus' name, we do pray and believe. Amen. We are going to read in the book of Psalms, uh, chapter 51 and verses 14. God is saying, that let's just lead how it is. it is. Deliver me from bold guiltness, O God. Thou God of my salvation, and my tongue will sing aloud of thy deliverance. Amen. O God bless your name. Deliver me from bold guiltness. Maybe we find ourselves that we are feeling guilty of something that we have done. But God will deliver us from that guiltiness we have done. You know, when we confess our sin, we say, God, I've done this. God, I've done this. Please forgive me. Have mercy on me. And then God will forgive you. And that guiltiness, you know, like you feel guilty that you have done something wrong, it will go away. And also, it's like a prayer. David was praying a prayer. And he's calling God his salvation God is our salvation what is salvation salvation is being saved from a certain thing I think it's being saved you know you are saved even from this uh, guiltiness it's not easy to feel like now oh I have to let this burden go so it's, it's, it's something that will come and save you from that uh, guiltiness because this guiltiness can cause you to do something dangerous so you are saved. That's why we say God our salvation. And when God saved us, because it's not easy to come out from something, to come out of that uh, thing that you feel guilty of, because you feel like you are free now, your tongue will sing of his glory forever. And God will be grateful. You go there and give a testimony that God delivered me from guiltiness, from self, you know. You cause so many questions that you ask in your mind. Oh, why did I do this? Why did I do this? Oh, oh. Uh, that guiltiness can even kill you. It can kill your dream. It can kill your future because you, you feel like you don't have future. This guiltiness is putting you, it's locking you somewhere. And by the grace of God, may God deliver us from the uh, the blood guiltiness and may we have freedom of doing things without any guilty may god bless you i love you so much 
May God keep you safe. Until next time, I love you. Shalom, shalom, shalom.